Please, good visitor. Tell me, have you come from Oxborough? My dear sister Florina embarked on a quest there some time ago, and I am anxious to hear a word of her welfare. Ah, that's an immense relief to hear. It is inspiring to watch new initiates face the trials of joining the Covenant. But when it's one's younger sister, it is impossible not to feel some apprehension. If you have come with hopeful dreams of enlisting with the Covenant yourself, it's only fair you know what you're getting into. A wraith stalks the lands, and some initiates gave in to fear and are now in even greater peril. Their cowardice has very likely led them to a dark fate, though it is neither surprising nor unjust. It appears that in their mad flight, they sought refuge in Clearview Crypt, which has now become disturbingly quiet. Now there's courage! I should warn you, however, Lumen Morales believes the Initiates engaged in heretical behavior. Templar Damiano went after them, but he has not returned. So go then, newcomer. I have a good feeling about you.
thank you for helping to resolve those... Uh, <laughs> ...unexpected consequences. We do important work here, studying Azos applications, but it is not without risks. Uh, please come in. If you would, introduce yourself to Cleo. <laughs> of Aventus. His enthusiasm for research is admirable, but it creates complications from time to time. He must make friends regularly. The Syndicate values those who help him uncomplicate his results. The Syndicate... Scholars, arcanists, inventors, explorers of every kind. This land suits the intellectually curious. Those who can handle a measure of danger, doubly so. You are welcome here. Return to Aventus. After that mishap with the wolves, I must return to experimenting and trying anew. A different formula, or perhaps a new approach. Fortunately, research is what this place was built for. What I am built for. Oh, you like them? If you join us in the Syndicate, they will be yours to use. Uh, should you be interested, I would like to test your mind, as well as your body. Azoth. The mysterious element that runs deep in this land. It is like nothing I ever experienced in the old world. Its potential applications are vast. Our very enclave itself is built near something quite special. Oh, you're sharp. No progress comes without danger. <clears throat> uh, take this bottle. Uh, mind the cliffs. Follow the path into Brightwood. Go through the grove and then to the moat. Consider that part of your test. You will know it when you see it. Oh, um, one more thing. Do not anger the creatures there. You will find that discretion can often serve you far better than brute force. seen the Azoth tree. It was truly beautiful, no? <laughs> well worth a little danger. Welcome to Eternum, my friend. Uh, you will have infinite time to take it in. Oh, I hoped you would see its true beauty. Uh, now, if I may have the infused water? <laughs> Here is your payment. <sighs> you would make a marvelous member of the Syndicate. However, you must first see an additional member of our order. Cleo has already requested a word, if you came back in one piece. Um, I see within you the same potential. Please, go and speak with her. Oh, I believe you are. Go to her and keep an open mind. The task she has prepared may challenge you in more ways than one. Ah, a moment, if you please. Thank you for speaking with me. Aventus has had much to say about you. Our order eagerly accepts capable candidates, and I hoped you would perform one final test to join our ranks. Shall we? The impermanence of death presents a peculiar conundrum when dealing with our adversaries. Let me ask you, how do you kill that which has no life? Well, we of the Syndicate aim to solve that. Indeed, this is an Azoth-infused sleeping draught, with which I hope to subdue our immortal foes. Pour it into the wells at Broken Hull Hold, 
and destroy their reserves to force them to drink it. Those who sleep do not fight. If they do not fight, they do not die. Those who do not die do not resurrect. The old world likened death to slumber. We are going to turn that metaphor into reality.
the fortitude of Templar Damiano is proven by his safe return, though it is your courage that saved him. It sounds like justice was served with the Initiates, but I wonder, how did they succumb to become corrupted? So they embraced the darkness of their own accord. Then I can only hope they suffered at your hand. I will gather any of the Initiate's belongings remaining in the Enclave and see them purged by fire. Lumen Morales would speak with you. She can seem strange, but she is one of the most respected members of the Order. She was my mentor, and I suggest you give great consideration to her words, for she is inspired. Very well. I must attend to cleansing the foul presence of those initiates from our sacred halls. When Florina returns, I hope all this is far behind us. Thank you for giving me this chance to express my gratitude for the rescue of Templar Damiano. I see in your eyes the light of a great potential. You would shine as a member of our order and bring inspiration to many struggling souls. Be assured, you are under no pressure to join the Covenant, but you have provided us with a strong case concerning your worthiness. I must ask, however, if you can help me with another matter, one requiring some discretion. I expected as much. The problem I need help with is related to Templar Titus Invectus, the one who oversaw the training of our fallen initiates. I'm afraid this has driven Titus quite mad, and he too is now corrupted, but through no fault of his own. No, because we won't allow that. Paranoia and rage make one susceptible to corruption, and that's why we'll keep this between us. The fallen initiates apparently corrupted the relic Titus wore as a necklace, and we must recover it and destroy it, quickly and quietly. Templar Invectus lurked somewhere in Nettleris graveyard. There's an old marker there he studied. It should lure him out. Defeat Invectus, bring back the corrupted relic, and then we can destroy it. I... Lethal is wrathful enough already.
You have recovered the relic from Invectus? Go. Now. Don't say a word. Simply cast it into the pyre. Their belief in justice is not misplaced. But we must forge our own justice. Lead, shepherd, step into my embrace. Let us protect Eternum together. There. Ah, now we can safely say this whole sordid affair is concluded with some measure of redemption. Lethold is a champion of righteousness and justice, and a strong leader. Uh, quite. The Covenant is as much about preserving hope as it is about seeing justice done. It is better for all of us that Lethold stays focused on the future. No need to dwell on these dark events. The whole Enclave is talking about what you've been doing around here. I can't believe we met on the side of a road. I believe it's time you officially became one of us. What do you say? <laughs> I am thrilled to hear you affirm your interest. The Covenant will shine brighter with you standing in our ranks. Go and speak to Lumen Beza. I have already vouched for your worthiness. And hope be with you. Always. <laughs> You return victorious. You are truly committed to the application of knowledge, and not just its pursuit. Despite how you may feel about the act itself, do know that this work will help the people of Everfall. As do I. If I am not, we will simply try something else. Should you wish, we would be honored to have you join our ranks. Speak to Astrid when you're ready. She can begin your initiation. The Syndicate is an eclectic group, one that would be honored to have you listed amongst our ranks. Please, if you wish to join us in the pursuit of unraveling the mysteries of Eternum, the time is now. Now that is some joyous news. Your letters of recommendation have already been furnished. Go to Scrivener Astrid, and she will process your records into our charters. From 
From the first, we knew you were one of us. It's in the way you carry yourself, you see? Stradaya has vouched for your valor, so it's time. Pledge our oaths and join our ranks. The choice is yours. Hail, warrior! You are a credit to our ranks. Do you seek more glory? Look no further. Missions are available here and anywhere else our banner flies. I also have arms and armor if you need. 